Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru. I'm here to tackle level 65. It's a hard level. Let's look at the board, figure out our strategy, then you can go off and play it on your own and see if you can beat it. I think you can. Or you can watch me play through in case you need more confidence. All right, so what have we got here? We've got a jelly level. Okay, we know it's a hard level, so we know there are going to be some blocks, some uh, obstructions. First of all, most of these in the center are single layer. But those in the nooks and crannies, the harder places to get to, those are double layer. And we've got these chocolate proliferating blo blocks in some of these nooks and crannies. They're going to take over unless we can take out one chocolate per turn. And, of course, we've got these licorice cages. We've only got 37 moves to do it. We also need to make 120,000 points to get one star. It's not high up on the meter board. Probably won't be a problem. If we're superstars, we can reach 310,000 points to get three stars, but we really just want to complete this hard level. So, we're looking here, and I already see some nice moves, some special moves, some moves that'll take out a chocolate. I see this wonderful special move right here that would make five in a row and give me a uh, color bomb. But first, I'm going to make a striped candy. I'm hoping it's not going to ruin my chances to make the color bomb, but it's going to take out a chocolate, so it's worth it to me. There we go. Now I can make my color bomb. It didn't take out a chocolate, so I have to watch out. I've got some other areas where I could have taken out a chocolate on a turn. I'm going to focus on those right now. Uh, and again, I see I've got another color bomb. It's hard for me to ignore the color bombs. Maybe what I'll do is I'll make this color bomb, let the chocolate grow a little bit, and get rid of some of these licorice cages. Let's try that instead. Okay, so I could take out all of the reds that would condense this blue it would uh, together take out this licorice and take out this cage uh, so let's do that because i've got other reds that are uh, trapped behind there we go now i could take out this whole row here plus uh, take out this chocolate by making this green collapse here Look at that, all the chocolates are now off the board. That's no longer a threat to me. Now I just have this licorice cage to contend with. I know I've got this color bomb. It's okay if it detonates on its own on a, uh, you know, a collapsing kind of cascade thing um, because it's still going to take out a color. If I can combine it with a special, if I can make a special and combine it, that's wonderful. But if I can't, that's okay too. I've got two opportunities for specials. Uh, I'm going to take this one first and I'll show you why. Uh, unless it cascades, I'll be able to make a better opportunity. I'll have a better opportunity for a, a special candy by doing this first. I make one striped candy, and now instead of making another striped candy or a wrapped candy down here, I can make another color bomb. Sorry, I've got a little bit of a cold, and it's early in the morning. I know this is not my best video, but it's a good screen, and I want to show you how... Um, to use these specials to your advantage. I wish I could communicate with the green here and take out all of these. That's not an opportunity I have right now, so I'm still just going to leave these alone. All right, now I'm going to try to get into these nooks and crannies. If I can't, I'm at least going to try to take out as many jellies as I can. Now I can get into this nook and cranny. I can also make a special here. Let's do that first. I'm going to take this out. Because there aren't quite so many colors on the board as some of the levels I've played, that's an advantage. See, my color bombs exploded, but it, it, they took with them quite a few of these different jellies that were stuck. I'm going to make this special. It's going to be, because I'm pushing this vertically, it's going to make a vertically striped candy that's going to be able to get into both of those nooks and crannies as soon as I detonate it. I've already got three stars, so obviously points are not a problem for me on this level. I'm going to both detonate this special and make another special and get rid of some of these. Now, when I detonate this and make a color bomb, it's probably going to explode the color bomb as well, but that's okay. It's going to concentrate the colors that are on the board. Oh, and it didn't. It made it off to the side, and it left me the opportunity to detonate it when I wish. I only have the opportunity to detonate a red here. A red's not a bad idea because it gets rid of these. I see so many opportunities for these specials here. Uh, so many opportunities to take out some of these um, nooks and crannies that are off to the side before I detonate my color bomb. 
if I do this, it's not going to take out these reds because I'm going to have exploded these reds already. Um, I, I don't see a real good reason to make this special. If I make a striped candy, it's going to take out the stripes that it's going to take out this this column where I don't have any jellies. If I make a wrapped candy, it's not near anything. And even if I bring it all the way down the board, it's not near anything that's going to explode. If I needed points and I wanted to make a wrapped candy and try to pair it with this, but I've already got all the points I need. So I'm going to detonate this red with this here. The reason I'm using this one instead of this one is this one has more opportunities to reach more jellies, especially, or candies, especially special candies. All right, so this was a really awful video, but it showed you really important key strategies. Um, and if you need help with any other videos, please, any other levels, oh my goodness, please put them in the comments below and I'll see what I can do to help you. If you found any of this helpful at all, please hit like and um, help me out a bit, please, because obviously I need it this morning. Thanks.